Good morning. Welcome. Hold on, something's wrong. Give me a second, I gotta go change. That's better. Good morning. So we're leaving the hotel here in DeWitt, Michigan, just a little bit north of Lansing. And uh, we're heading to Howe Western Wear in Howe, Michigan today, and then to the Wire Horse in Lennon, Michigan. A little bit of a slow start. I had some computer problems that still aren't really resolved, but we'll figure it out. We've also got some ice issues. I don't know if you can see that or not, but the, we got some ice last night. And I forgot to bring the ice scraper, so we're sitting here letting the defrost do its thing. Um, I did hear that they're expecting some pretty good weather coming towards Grand Rapids tomorrow, which is where I was hoping to be tomorrow. So we may have to change that plan. We'll just play it by ear. Um, but when the Michiganians are worried about the weather, it's probably wise to, to heed their advice. But anyway, um, we're gonna be off here in just a little bit, heading to Howell Western Wear, and then to the Wire Horse. So we made it here to Howe Western Store in uh, Howe, Michigan. It's a beautiful store in a great little downtown setting, but that also means that there's no parking. So that means we gotta haul everything, which does not thrill me. Here we go. Actually, this is some nice stuff. Yeah, so we got a brand new line. So we introduced this line to call the Rebel Pro in the men's last time. I also so I like it. Like I like it a lot, actually. So yeah, so it's called the Rebel Pro. Something cool about it is it's got two shanks. So it's got two fiberglass shanks. We call it the dually shank system. wrapped up with Hal Western Wear here in Howell, Michigan. Uh, great meeting with Lynn. Uh, Got to thank her a bunch for letting me stop by. Y'all should have seen me walking with my little wagon slipping on the ice in the cowboy hat in downtown Main Street. <laughs> I should have got a video of that. Um, so yeah, we're off to Linden, Michigan to the Wire Horse to go meet those girls and uh, we're out.
just now leaving the hotel room here in DeWitt, Michigan. We're heading to the town of Wayland, Michigan, which is just south of Grand Rapids, uh, to meet up with Jackson's Western Store, get caught up with Kim and her crew. It's early afternoon because our appointment isn't until later this afternoon, um, which worked out really good because that gave me some time to get caught up on my computer work, get my computer working, first of all, which was good, get some of the editing done for the videos, and uh, yeah, just in general, get caught up. Wayland's about an hour and a half away from where we're at right now, which should get me there right about on the time uh, as our meeting. I might be a touch early. So we just finished up our meeting here at Jackson's Western Wear. Great meeting. Something I did not realize that I learned today is that this year they are celebrating their 50th anniversary. So that's super cool. Um, but yeah, Kim was great and I don't know, it was just a good, good visit. Um, I'm about six hours from home currently. Uh, it's about 4.30 in the afternoon, so there's no way I'm gonna make it all the way home. So the plan is to just drive until, I don't know, I get tired and uh, find a place to, to crash there. Uh. 
So anyway, we're leaving the hotel here in, where am I? Jackson, Michigan. So we're leaving the hotel in Jackson, Michigan, uh, heading home. They're calling for some real bad weather back home this time. They're talking about maybe 12 inches of snow on Saturday. Uh, so I'm going to kind of deadhead at home uh, to make sure that I get home in time to get uh, feed for all the animals. But that's the plan. About four, four and a half hours away from home right at the moment. While I'm driving, I'm going to be making some appointments for next week. So we have somewhere to go next week. So it's another dark and dank day here in Michigan. But uh, here we go. Mm -hmm. 